Hello, my name is Mr. Saul, and I'd like to talk about the cashier's position, the cashiers of the store. If you are chosen to take cash, please listen to the following, so you'll have an idea of what your position is all about. It's very important because you're dealing with cash. When you're dealing with money, you have to be extra careful, and you have to have some certain sense of responsibility. Cashiers must possess certain qualities, and the qualities are simply accuracy, you have to have some sort of speed while doing your job, and of course, you have to be honest. So it is important to have these three characteristics. But much more important than speed are the other two traits, which is accuracy and honesty. If a mistake is made, you must call a manager so that we can rectify the situation, go over it, correct it, and go on from there. You might find yourself in a situation where a line is building up and you are sort of panicking. You want to finish with the customers. You want to get rid of that line. But if you do find yourself in that position, what you have to try to do is be cool. Be calm and just call a manager for assistance. And before we put you on a register, we probably, in our opinion, do think that you are capable, unless proven otherwise. So please don't disappoint us in our choice, the choice of choosing you as a cashier. We don't want to be disappointed, and we don't want to be caught in any type of embarrassing situations with you as far as going to court and so on and so forth. This is a very important position. Therefore, you must follow the specific rules given to you. And they're all outlined in the cashier's manual that will be given to you once you start your position as cashier. The manual has every possible point concerning the process for taking cash. Yes. Please follow it carefully, follow it precisely, and anything you're not sure about, ask and you will know. But as far as the specific points, you will find, as I said in the manual, Anything that you're not sure about, you must ask the manager. Whether it's something in the manual or outside the manual, anything with you paying out money, anything that has to do with anything other than the regular taking of cash, the manager or assistant manager has to know about it. Okay, of course you know the cash register drawer has money in it. So if you're going to turn around for any specific reason, Having to do anything to step away from the register, please make sure that the drawer is closed because you never know who could put his hand or her hand in there. So just to protect yourself and to protect the store, do not turn around, do not give your back to the drawer at any time while it's open. Another general point is to make sure that every bag of merchandise going out of the store given to a customer has a receipt stapled to it. We do check at the front of the store that each bag has a receipt. Each bag should have a receipt. The merchandise in that bag should be rung up where the receipt on the bag is clearly itemized as to what is in the bag. So if we should open the bag in front of the store, the receipt on the bag itemized must exactly match the contents of the bag. We'd like you also to be aware of the change artists. These are people that specialize in coming to stores, giving you a certain amount of money, and trying to play around with the money back and forth, where they're going to wind up ahead and making your register short. So if you sense any one of these people coming in, again, take a step back, stop what you're doing, and all you have to do is call the manager. Like this, you'll have sort of two heads instead of one trying to overcome what that change artist is trying to do. So again, be aware of that and keep calling us to avoid any kind of trouble as far as that is concerned. If you're having any problem with a customer, call the manager and he'll take over and solve the problem. Any quarrels that might arise between you and the customer. However, 
We want you to stay away from that. We want you to have no quarrels between you and the customer. No fights at all, no arguments. Just if the customer is feeling like arguing for any reason whatsoever, again, step back, call the manager, and we will calm things down. Your area, the register area, has to be clean at all times has to be neat. It has to be filled with the supplies list that the assistant manager will be showing you. Everything has to be intact in your registered area. Everything has to be in place. Anything from bags to staples to staplers and so on and so forth. Keep your area clean. Remember, you spend a lot of hours, a lot of time in that register area. So we expect you to treat it as if it was your own home. Make sure that it's clean, neat, and organized at all times. Fill the supplies required. Well, that basically covers, in a general point of view, the cashier's job. However, I urge you to read the manual very precisely and very carefully, which is found in the programs of all cash registers, because it has all the specific points that you should know. You are responsible for these points on the manual, and you will be tested. Please make sure to take time off to read it, time off to understand it, so that you'll know, you will be sure that you know what you're doing, and you will have no problem with anyone in the store as far as management and customers. So please be very careful, be very precise and try to do the best you can on the cashier's job. Because it is a privilege indeed to be a cashier in one of our stores. So thank you and good luck.